Do you have the time to listen to me whine about nothing and everything I like? Hello, hello. How's everybody doing? ¿Qué has hecho? I know you guys are like, who the hell is this? Because y'all haven't heard my voice in a minute, but it is moi. I'm here with a package. I have a package I got from Ant Acrylics. I got it about two weeks ago, I want to say. It's just been a minute. I have a lot of stuff I have to finish editing and uploading. I'm so sorry. I've just been really chaotic and hectic over here. Uh, this is going to be a very short video. I want to get straight to it. So this is the second time that I've ordered Ant Acrylics. I know a lot of people, there's like a lot of hype behind her, um, her product, you know, a lot of people, they're for it, they're against it, they like it, they don't, they have issues with it. I'm going to just basically say this. Um, you have to try it for yourself, like straight up. You just have to. I, I was nervous. So I was like, ah, should I, should not spend this money on it? I mean, just buy one, try it out. Well, I mean, you know, because then shipping, whatever. Maybe just get a little, you know, a couple, like four or something. So this is her chocolate collection. Maybe you can try getting her chocolate collection. Normally it's $70. She has it on sale right now for $45. And these colors are beautiful. They are really pretty browns. Fall is amongst us. It is in the air. It is the perfect time to purchase some brown acrylics, if you will, or brown anything of full colors. These chocolates are so cute. They say MILF on them, and they're chocolate and white chocolate. So cute. Um, I will say this about her her powders. I like to call them marshmallowy. That's what I call them. They're like marshmallowy. So they're very soft. They're 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 extremely um, uh, malleable, I guess, if you want to call it that. Uh, and then these were two powders that I bought from her Halloween collection. I want to say she, she came up with her Halloween collection last year, but I'm not 100% on that. So don't quote me on it. I got her jack-o'-lantern in her brain. And those are glow-in-the-darks. So um, we's getting started. Uh, and this is my Aoki Tech brush that I got from Timu, which I have a video on that coming out. But I believe that brush was like three something on Timu. And that's a size 18, baby. And that brush is so freaking good for real like no jokes y'all gonna y'all gonna see y'all gonna see do you see how it just stays on the swatch stick like that yeah exactly thank you those are her acrylics so basically if hers i know i have it like in super fast motion but if you see that i'm doing a lot of padding versus dragging that's kind of how you would use her acrylics so you want to pat them in place and once you get it where you have it where you want it like i've patted it down it's covering the swatch stick then i can do my 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 dragging if you will or my see my cleanup you know the kind of smoothing it out that we do at the end that's how you do that again you can see it stays in place you pat it down and then you can pull it um you know once you get it where you want it at so I think that that's the issue a lot of times. People want to like just put it down and drag it and pull it. The main thing that you have to remember here, like with any other acrylic, is that it's it's all about your liquid to powder ratio. That's just, that goes without saying. That's for any powder. I don't care what brand it is. If you can't get your liquid to powder ratio down, packed, you're going to have an issue every time. And so that's, it took me a minute and I'm like, I'm, don't get me wrong. I'm still not good at it. You, uh, you, and every product is different. You almost have to just test it. You know what I'm saying? You try it a little more drier than normal. And then you see, okay, this is too dry. I'm add a little bit more to it. Or you can try it a little wetter, but like, okay, whoa, that's too much. I'm going to pull back. This one, I took in a little wetter. So you can see even at, at, at a, a wetter, uh, consistency, it still didn't run off the, the swatch stick. They're, they're they're really good, y'all. Like I I like them. I think they're perfect, and they're they're really good for beginners. They're also really good for um and more advanced. So, you know, it's just it's really about trying it yourself. Of course, you know, uh, re um, reviews are nice because you get to see it at work and see how it works. Um, and so I think visual is important, but my opinion is my opinion. Everybody's opinion is different. We all know that. So a visual always helps. Y'all can see what I'm doing. You see how it works. You see that I'm not struggling. And y'all know my work. I am not a professional by any means. I need a lot of help and I need a lot of Jesus with my nails. So, so I mean, if I can do it, you know what I'm saying? But anyhow, be that as it may, um, right now she does have all of her colors. She's got her princess collection, her kawaii collection, her fall collection, her chocolate collection, her nude collection is the only one that's sold out in a collection. The nude collection, 
but she does have it sold as individuals. And of course, all the collections you can buy individually. The only color that I can think that I remember seeing today sold out was her Maleficent, which is her black. I want to say everything else is there, I think. And then she has her winter collection also, um, which I did I did purchase her some of her winter collection from the first time that I ordered. And, and they were really cute, you know. Um, but my heart is, my heart belongs to bomb nails. Like it just does. Bomb nails is the shat. This is her Halloween right here. I just, I just swatched the jack-o'-lantern. I know y'all wondering what happened with the, with the mocha and it just jumped into jack-o'-lantern. I didn't notice, but my phone had stopped recording. And then when I did notice I was already doing jack-o'-lantern and it was too late. I couldn't go back on it. So this one is called brain, brain or brains, one or the other. And, and these two, the jack-o'-lantern and the brain are both, uh, glow in the dark. And these are part of her Halloween collection. So, and she does have those available amongst other colors. Um, but yeah, y'all can just check it out yourself and see, you know, she has her tips on sale also, but, um, you know, just go check it out. See what you think. Uh, if you'd like, if not, then you can just watch it being applied and just give your own opinion based, uh, based off of what you see in here in front of you. You know what I'm saying? So hopefully I'm back for good. This is her chocolate collection. It's beautiful. And then the two uh, from her Halloween. I really appreciate y'all coming in and watching. Thank you so much for supporting. I love yous. I hope to see yous on the next one. I, I really apologize that it took so long. I still have to get my full like set that I just recently uploaded of my, you know, work with me or whatever. But anyways, thank y'all for watching. I will catch you on the next one. I love everybody. I love each and every one of y'all. Goodbye and adios.